Right. Today, 80% of Americans have access to a public recycling program. Recycling one ton of plastic saves 7.4 cubic yards of landfill space and can save 1 to 2,000 gallons of gas. Alright, now how many of you guys actually recycle? Alright, recycling is one of the best ways for you to have a positive impact on the world in which we live. Recycling is important to both natural environment and us. We must act on the amount of waste we create, and it is increasing all the time. Today I'm going to change your mind about recycling. I'll be talking about why recycling is important and what, we can, what you can do to recycle. Now that you know what I'm talking about, let's find out why recycling is important. Tom Hernandez from overland.education.com says that Americans throw away enough glass bottles and jars every two weeks to fill the former World Trade Center. Alright, one of the reasons why that, re that re recycling is so important is because recycling saves a lot of energy. When new products are manufactured from the raw materials obtained the re from recycled products, it saves a lot of energy which is consumed for the production for production. When new products are manufactured from virgin materials, the amount of energy consumed is much higher. Besides the energy required to acquire the tr and transport the virgin raw materials from their origins and natural resources is also safe. Add to that the energy which is required to clean and pr protect the environment from the pollutant waste products, especially those which are non-biodegradable and fill up the landfill areas. Another reason is recycling saves environmental conditions and reduces pollution. Recycling helps in preventing global climate change to a great extent. By, mi by minimizing the energy spent on industrial pro production, recycling also helps in reducing greenhouse gas emissions. Some of the major fossil fuels used in the most, in most industries include coal, diesel, gas, and etc. fuels. All these emit harmful gases such as methane, sulfur dioxide, carbon dioxide, and others to the environment. The processing of fresh raw material also creates toxic materials to pollute the environment. But if by reducing the energy used, recycling also minimizes the amount of fuel usage in which in turn reduces the amount of harmful pollutants in the environment. Um, another reason why recycling is important is because recycling saves natural res resources. We know that recycling involves the process and usage of the core elements of an old product for the pr production of new products. This helps, this helps in saving our natural resources to a great extent. For example, once an old newspaper is recycled, uh, you, don't need new, you don't have to go, get out, go out and get a bunch of new resources, you don't have to chop down a bunch of trees. To create more newspapers, you can just recycle <coughs> old ones to make new um, newspapers. Um, and one more of uh, the um, benefits of recycling is the economic benefits. Similar to energy and natural resource, recycling also helps in saving a lot of expenses and demand for the pro production of new from virgin materials. These expenses include the entire production cycle starting from acquiring the raw materials, transferring them from their virgin to, pr to production places, um, processing and manufacturing costs. Recycling process creates employment opportunities for a lot of people involved in the various stages of the process. This, turns in, this in turn contributes to the economic development of our state and country. Recycling saves space for waste disposal. Um, most of the landfill sites are filled up with a lot of waste products that could have been recycled effectively. Some of these waste materials belong to non-biodegradable category, which takes a lot of time to com decompose. Recycling enables poor uses of these waste products and saves space for landfills. The place in which landfills are getting filled up Soon we might run short of landfills unless we start following recycling at our home 
and spread the word to others. Alright, now that you know why recycling is important, let me show you what you can do to recycle in your, pretty much in your community. As Patty Nelson from RecyclingRevolution.com states, to produce a week, each week's Sunday newspaper, 500,000 trees must be cut down. Um, find out which, what recycling programs or center exist in your area. It's no use trying to recycle something if there's no process center near you. Um, deter determine what categories um, of each item you're recycling for which area. Like you pretty much in your house you set up an area for bottles, cans, paper, and cardboard, stuff like that. So that you, um, it's easier to s sort them and for the um, uh, recycling place. Um, leave your bins in an appropriate collection area or take your recycling to a process center yourself once you've accumulated enough, accumulated enough to make worth the trip because recycling is worth money so if you get enough to make enough money it's worth it to make your own trip. Um, also you can reduce the amount that you use so reuse water bottles and um, stuff like that. When cleaning when cleaning and, and buying using buying use, reused items you can prevent millions and tons of trash from going into the landfills. So reuse the glass pickle jar, turning it into a beautiful base or those packing peanuts you got from a for a present from your mom. You can use them to pack stuff for your friend, to get to your friend too. Um, like for an example, if orange juice spills on the counter, you don't want to use the whole roll of paper towels. You can use like one paper towel or you can just use a sponge instead of using a bunch of paper towels. Um, the same concept goes when you're buying groceries. They sell those. They sell the new uh, grocery bags that aren't plastic. They're uh, like uh, I don't know what they're made out of, but <laughs> they're made. They're not plastic, so you're saving uh, five cents per bag. And uh, when you buy a package of meat, um, you don't use the grocery bag. You don't use um, the grocery bag for one item each. So you can use, uh, put a bunch of items in one grocery bag to save more stuff. Um, all right. And the last way you can do it is to buy um, items that are already made from recyclables. So it saves uh, a lot of money. You can buy wood benches, CD racks made from leftover construction lumber, mouse pads from recycled plastic and tires, and many more items that are recyclable. Can you think of, of other easy things you can do to reduce the amount of trash you create? Reuse the things you can. Alright, I hope you guys have a better understanding about recycling and that you guys recycle more often. And that's it. <laughs> Ryan, what did you think? Um, I think your topic is pretty important. I, um, I thought your class survey question was probably not the best idea since so many people already recycled. Um, I think you tended to read off your cards more than I talk to the audience. But yet you sorted your your sources and had some good ways to help us recycle and reuse things. I thought it was good. And yeah. All right.